guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming where we are continuing our Julia Let's Play on the original Rome Total War. Now last episode we got kicked out of Alexandria by rebels as usual. Um, now we're coming south with our armies up here. We should hopefully have the old Marian reforms soon and we are a bit late on them. Um, and we took Condate Redonum. Uh, now, it was unfortunate we kind of messed up the battle against Ale uh, Alexandria because we could have uh, got uh, into the city again without a siege battle. But it was basically 2% of the army we missed out on killing, which was the horsemen. So they managed to escape just about. But we're going to put an end to that. So first thing, to, I think we're just going to auto-resolve this if the odds are good enough. They should be like 20 to 1, 25 to 1, okay. Okay, they killed 38, reasonable amount. Uh, we didn't lose anyone, no one died. And this time we're going to exterminate them. Because the public order was so bad last time. Now we've retaken the Ferris of Alexandria. Half the chance of nearby ships sinking, which is fine. Um, we've still got our temple here. Now, what do we want to do? I think we want to build the archery range so that we can build archers as soon as possible. Because uh, when those Marian reforms fire, we want to build, you know, a nice army. This army's fine. We won't be able to retrain anyone though after uh, after that. So, let's see what we can do here about just retraining one unit two units um, and then Prinkapes doesn't look like we can spread any Prinkapay experience try with these guys um, and then one more yeah left with two and then one of these guys yeah that's built up some experience twice which is great now yeah that's all we need to retrain and maybe hmm what do we want to do here maybe another Byream Let's just keep going with the ships to make Ready sure we don't get sunk while we're out here. Because we want to kind of uh, hop along if we can. Yeah, resistance is futile, Alexandria. That is really annoying that there was a Senate mission for that as well because it was a rebel settlement, but we needed to take it. Um, and let's worry about what are we going to do up here. Uh, I mean, that I assume is from this. Yeah, great to miss our weapons. Nope, I'm not the center of Jupiter. Would this be okay if we carried on moving? If we just got one uh, one peasant? And I would say we stick one of these guys in. Yeah, it would. So, let's carry on moving then. I think I don't want to risk losing it though. Though, So, you just go there and let's take that barbarian mercenary. Just in case, because I really don't want to risk losing it. Now let's get down to Lamonum if we can. There should be another... We destroyed that big Gaul army, but there should be another army somewhere. Or I could just be... That could have been that singular Gaul army. What's this? Warband. I mean, I think we've got to fight it, just because if we auto-resolve and we lose... I, we're screwed. They will take Narbo. So, and they can recruit from there. We don't need to listen to the general speech because it's just a captain. So, it doesn't really matter. Now, we're just going to fire Peeler into them and uh, go for them. Oh my days, no. I don't want you to fight my peasants. <laughs> peasants, go there. Just stay there if you can. Uh, let's not run. Let's just march. No, let's, let's just march just because we'll get too tired otherwise. They are at the top of the hill as well. Now the peasants will just do the mop-up job. If they uh, if they route, the peasants will uh, mop them up. I'm thinking they won't move towards us, honestly, because they're on, a, on the defensive and they're at the top of the hill. Um, but yeah, cool. Come on, speed up. And I think we'll leave one unit of Hastati in Narbo and then send the other one back. Maybe even up to Elysia, just, just to firm up the defences at Elysia. Okay, now they're coming, right. Peasants, you come down. They're going to probably get one, one volley off. 
Uh, okay, don't get a volley off then, that's fine. They're very slow with their volleys, but they are deadly, so I can't really complain too much. I didn't do anything, did it? <laughs> the peasant charge from behind! The mighty peasants. Let's go. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. The mighty peasants. They're steady. Watch the peasants destroy their morale. Yeah, the feet are just, they're shaken. The peasants are gonna destroy them. Let's go, let's go, let's go, boys. Whoa, the mighty peasant charge. The impact is brutal. Oh my god, it just took killing that one dead little general. The enemy's hearts are full of fear and now they flee! Can kill them completely. That'll be good. Only 72% right now. Peasants should be faster than them because they've got no armor. Get above yeah, we're above 85 now, so that should be it. Cool. I mean, we actually lost more men than I was anticipating, but mainly because of that volley at the start, they just didn't... Oh, we got a man of the hour for that. I mean, we'll take it, because he's good, and he's only 21. Orders. Um, what do we want to do with you, though? Could send you up to Elysia? Could actually send you back when the Marian Reform comes in next turn. Then we're going to be recruiting some more troops from around here, aren't we? So, if we send you back, you can be ready to take on any sort of challenge. Now, we will leave these Sestati in Narbo because we need to. And you can come back this way. Um, you're done. Elysia up here. You're okay. Recruiting peasants. Did that change? I thought I recruited. A... I thought I was recruiting peasants last turn. I don't know. Now we don't want to recruit anyone until uh, we get the Marine reforms next turn. Let's do the uh, construction and then we'll go over to Egypt have a look. All right, Thermon. Let's go with the marketplace. Carthage arena. Yeah, that's made them a lot happier. Let's try to get rid of the squalor. Uh, public health bonus should help. Uh, it's just giving public order, not taking away the squalor. Um, I mean, the Pantheon is good, but it's just extra population growth. We really don't need that right now. So, Thapsus. Let's just go with walls on Thapsus. It only takes three turns, and it's just in case Namidia decides to attack. Um, Larissa. Just upgraded you. Awesome. Um, what can we do here? Probably go with the market. Potentially worth thinking of this area as a recruitment hub as well. But it doesn't look like we've got a huge amount of barracks and stuff over here. So it might not be worthwhile. So we've got Larissa, now Missalia. Recruit, uh, retrain those peasants. They gave them some lovely uh, armor. Roads. Let's go with the shipwright again. That should help with the trade. Alicanarsis. Um, honestly, population growth will be the most beneficial here right now. Mazaka. Probably go for that. Uh, Sinope. Uh, we do have Vibius here, which is helping a lot. But let's go for the sewers, get some public health. Um, right. Princope is there. Do we want to recruit anyone else? Probably not. Now, we have this one spy. How about we recruit another spy? Unless... I thought we had one more spy over here. Okay, let's just recruit another one. It's fine. Not a diplomat spy. We don't want to be making peace with anyone, so... Diplomat is not a worry. Now, what do we do here? Do we... Defend against these armies? I think we do. We're going to get the Marion reforms next turn. And when we do... Let's see whether we can recruit archers. If we can recruit archers, then we'll recruit a load of archers for this siege. Which will be awesome. Uh, we do have these guys as well. So let's keep moving them along. Then that Numidian, uh, Numidian town has a ton. has a huge army inside it. So we don't want to worry about that too much. 
Right, we're doing all right. We're doing good. Uh, once we... Oh, I didn't see this. Hmm. Uh, it's just slingers, though. I mean, if they attack... Not slingers, skirmishers. If they attack, we should win that. How many turns has it got? Five. We do want to build an army here. So, between Thapsus and uh, Carthage. So, if we want to build an army... Looks like they've got reasonable barracks and stuff. Let's go for that archery range. See whether we can get archers at Thapsus. And we'll build an army, probably a half stack or maybe a three quarter stack, just to come through here and clean, clean it up. And then we'll move it to Iberia. Um, this army as well will go down south. And this one... Actually, once we've taken Lemonum, this army can march... Yeah, we'll go south. Spain's probably an easier target than, than the Bretons, just because of the Bretons' chariots. Although, if Spain's got bull warriors, they are pretty OP, but, you know, I'm sure we'll be okay. Recruit these guys, uh, retrain these guys, just because we can. And let's end the turn there. Should be Marion reforms, I'm hoping, next turn. Okay, they're going to attack us. Uh, I mean, we'll fight it. I doubt they'll be able to win. I mean, we'll probably just send our cavalry out and, and run them around the city so that they uh, get shot by the towers. I mean, the cavalry should be even be able to charge them. Today we face them. Um, that's where they are. I mean, we should be able to charge out of this gate without it being too much of a worry. We'll keep you on top of here, and you'll be firing at them while they uh, are down there. You here, and then peasants here. They're not going to be able to do anything against us, honestly. So, I mean, it's kind of silly that they would have attacked this. I mean, I'm hoping that it means... Let's run this way, guys. We should get fired up plenty. Yeah, they're already losing a load of people. Nope, they want to go back that way. That's fine, you can do. How much ammunition do we have? Not much. They're not even going to turn. They, well, well, we will destroy this whole unit straight, like, before they've even got to the got to the walls. Then that means this unit here. Destroyed. They will have to take the uh, battering ram and they'll just get shot. So let's do that. Let's wait until they've started battering down the walls and then we'll charge them again. Should be getting shot pretty much now. Yeah, there we are. Getting shot a lot. They're not going to enjoy that. Oh yeah, we're firing javelins at them as well. Ah, uh, I wish we could have destroyed that last little, last few men. But, looks like we couldn't, unless they were destroyed. Okay. Marion reforms. This guy's 42. No thanks. Blockade Sidon. No. Or Sidon or whatever. Death, ah, oh, I didn't look at where the Death Stalks are land. Could be somewhere good. If it was in Carthage, that would be good. Oh, Batavium. That's really not wanted right now. Really, really, really not wanted. Uh, we can only recruit Roman cavalry here as well, so let's go for the Hippodrome. Right. We can recruit Praetorians. We can't recruit Urbans just yet, but Praetorians are good enough. Hmm. Yeah, we just don't have the recruitment capability right now around this area. So let's go with the Praetorians. It's going to take ages to recruit them anyway. So let's go for like 10 of them. Um, if we had a couple of other places that we could recruit Praetorians. Oh, uh, we will be able to in Ariminium a Ariminium in a sec. Don't need those spear units. They're terrible. Um, now we could go for we want four Archer Auxilia. Um, and then a load of Cavalry. And then a few a few Praetorians and a few urban cohorts if we can. So Eretium, we are continuing building the armorer. We'll upgrade everyone at Eretium. Pratavium, we're building the Hippodrome so we can get legionary cavalry. Now Carolus, 
honestly just build all of this we've got the money um, until you need upgrading so Jessica, yeah same here and then Kydonia okay Kydonia is a bit more nuanced so let's do that and then Sardis wooden wall um, go for the that and that and that that's fine uh, Lugdunum only one thing we can go for retrain these guys Elysia hmm, no we want military stuff here so let's go for the armorer and now we can build an army here it's gonna be a bit of a rubbish army it's not gonna be hugely brilliant uh, but it should suffice against say the Germans and the Brit Britons um, I mean the Bretons are not easy because of the chariots but we should still be fine, I'm hoping anyway. Let's go for Lamonum. Could have stuck that uh, spy in there then, I don't know why I didn't. Right, you, we want you down to here to see what's going on. Now it looks like they're going to attack this uh, settlement again. If they do, how many units have they got? They got two units versus our two Hastati, I'm sure we'll win. Uh, we don't need any of those guys. So let's see what we want to recruit. So here, nothing right now. Probably, oh, is that allow? Oh, is this only for? Yeah, surely Praetorians here. Why can't we recruit normal legionaries? We can only recruit early legionaries here. That's weird. That's fine though. Uh, we'll be recruiting Praetorians from here, and then as soon as this is done, we will recruit uh, legionary cavalry. When this is done as well, we'll probably upgrade the barracks. Um, and if we can upgrade the armories as well, that would be awesome. Now Carthage, we want to build an army down here. So, what do we want? We don't want Arcana either. Trash. Let's go with Praetorian Cohorts. Let's just get loads of them again. And then over here... Doesn't look like we're going to get Praetorian Cavalry at any point soon. Yeah, it's a long way off. So, let's just go for some Roman Cavalry. Maybe like six. Uh, do we? Can we recruit a Serta? Yeah, we can, but nothing important. So, that's fine, that's fine. Um, now, over in Alexandria, can we recruit the lovely Archers? No, we can't. Can recruit Praetorians, though. They are strong. Hmm. They are swarming around here. Let's just go for some Praetorians. If they want to, you know, if they want to attack us at Alexandria, that's fine. We can bide our time while we build up our proper armies. Mazaka, we got that spy. Awesome. Let's bring that spy around this way, maybe. So this army, we're going to attack the Seleucids. Take the Sicilian pirates. They're fine. No way. I... That's gutting. I thought we'd be able to reach this. If I'd have split them up, we would have been able to reach it. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Let's press Control A. Hmm, we need to get rid of one person here. I mean, we could just merge these guys. Let's do that. Now, Mazaka. Mazaka's not happy. If we just recruit a load of peasants, will it make it happy? Ooh, just about. I think it might riot, but it won't um, rebel. Looks like it's faster to go that way. Okay, we'll go after the uh, Seleucid capital then. Can't do it, sir. Onward. Move to also, uh, Lentulus is 31 and he is awesome. He's a really good commander. Amuleus. Oh, why is Amuleus in charge? We need Quintus. Hmm. Amuleus is 38 as well, which is not ideal. Can we get rid of you? Yeah, we can. Wondering whether if we send this guy up here, it will sort out the uh, public order. I'm hoping it will. Um, now, can we build an army here as well? We have the money, so it's like... We might as well build what we can. Over at Alexandria, we really need to take these three, and we'll be able to pump out armies really quickly. Um, for now, though, they have a lot of big armies around. I think we just leave them. 
for the time being. Now, did we siege this this turn? Yeah, we did. Okay, we'll have a siege battle next turn then, that's fine. Oh, well, I suppose we'll have this battle. Where's that come from? Why have they decided to attack us like that? we got two faction guys, that's fine. I wonder, is that the faction heir? Where's the faction leader? Must be down in Spain. If we killed the faction leader after this battle, I reckon we'd probably have it. Now, we just wait in the middle for this one, and then we'll wait for them to come to us so they don't try and escape. Today, Let's listen to, to uh, this speech. The Warriors both worthy and brave in equal measure. Are you men enough to win this battle? Are you equal to the challenge? If you are, then plunder and loot await. This is the last obstacle in our way before the city walls. Win here, and you can stroll to your prize. We stand on the defensive today. Let them wear themselves out against our battle line. The count of our warriors is vastly greater than theirs. So unless we fight like old women or idiots, victory is certain. They do not have the spearmen to counter our horsemen. We can pin them down and destroy them. Many times I have faced these people, and still they are too stupid to learn their lesson. True Today, that. men will die to teach them afresh that they should simply run away. Brave Romans, prepare to defend yourselves! Cool. Let's uh, battle these guys. Right. We should be very close to destroying the Gauls now. Now... This land that we're taking, as I said, that's why we went for the other tactic of going towards uh, Alexandria and Greece and, and um, not Alexandria and Greece, well, Egypt and Greece early on, rather than the other, going the traditional route as the Julii. The have brought up more men. And what are they going to do? Now, these guys did attack us, so... I'm assuming that if we just kill that one unit, they're not going to try and run away. Because they have two generals' bodyguards. They think they're ours. When they're not. Ah, these archers are so... Look at their range. It's, it's horrendous. They can't even fire at these guys right now. I can't, I can't wait too long. It's too, it's too boring to just wait. How were we? How were those archers not able to fire yet? Oh my days! That's so bad. Just keep firing at them. The enemy show their true virtue. Awesome. They are not soldiers, right. only frightened. Let's, uh, let's spin these guys around. Ah! No, I the think they might go dead. to opposite sides. His I'm hoping no, not. They do no, not they don't. Good, good, good. Clever units. Awesome. These, yeah, that's why we really need to change these archers up for the, uh, whatever they are, the auxiliary archers. Because the auxiliary archers are a hundred times better. hundred times better. They, they've got long range missiles, I'm pretty sure. Uh, they got more armor, be better in melee, just better in every single way, really. Go over there, yeah, that's fine. I'm sure they're gonna chase us with someone, whether it's the warband or whether it's the general. Um, let's come up this way, see whether we can get through onto the general. I think we can just fit through that gap, honestly. We might get caught up on that warband, uh, but. It's not going to be much of a worry. I want to just kill the general, they'll all break. Oh, these guys are these guys running? Jesus. They are cowards. Love an egg. We should kill this guy. ASAP. Come on. Yeah, he's gone. He's gone. My god, these, these archers are terrible. Oh my god! Everyone's dead. Oh, we need to get rid of. of fear and now they flee. We need to get rid of these. I don't think we're going to be able to, honestly. 
They're gonna they're gonna survive this with their singular general. Now we probably can probably no, that's awful. That's really bad. It's really annoying. Um, yeah, I, I think they'll be fresh as well. So yeah, yeah. There's no chance we're gonna catch them, is there? Unless, oh, maybe there is. They're getting closer, but the red line's just there. Ah, gutted, 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 gutted. But I suppose we can just uh, auto resolve it. He only has 15 men left. I mean, if. I don't know, if it, if it kills like a hundred of our men, it's not a huge worry. Engage the enemy. So let's do that. It's a 20 to 1. Yeah, he only killed two. Victory! Definitely worth doing that. Now, what do we do here? I mean, it looks alright. I wish you could see the settlement details before you chose that option. Get rid of this. Uh, get the try to keep her in there. I think I'm going to it. Yes, we can. Um, now, can we keep moving? If we just left you in there. We can, we can, we can. Uh, now, I think instead of leaving that archer, I know that they're, they're kind of trash. Oh my god, come on. Uh, we haven't got any mercenaries available. So. Let's give the. Hmm. There we are. Mix that. Mix that uh, around. Mix the experience around. There we are. Perfect. And let's see whether we can come down to the last Gallic settlement. Your Honor, secrecy is a show. Faction announcements. Marriages. That's good. They're gonna have kids then soon. We're the strongest faction now. I don't know who was. Probably Egypt. Blimey, that's a lot of death. 2,000 people dying in Patavium. We need it to get up to a huge city as soon as possible as well. Hmm. That's fine though. As soon as that's gone, we'll be okay. Um, okay, we built that barracks here. So let's get some Praetorian cohorts here as well. Uh, now we need more cavalry capability, so let's keep going with the cavalry. Unless we want the blacksmith. I think getting up to being able to recruit legionary cavalry as quick as possible is definitely more important than the blacksmith right now. We also have the blacksmith in Eretium, so it's not a huge worry about... We can just retrain everyone out of Eretium. Sparta, what are we going to do here? Let's go with the crop rotation. Corinth, uh, let's go with the public health, especially seeing as we have a plague somewhere that we're trading with um, that's not ideal let's go with the roads at Halicarnassus now now Pergamon what are we gonna do health again probably and public order now Sinope Sinope's kind of happy now but it won't be when Vibius dies because of his influence it looks like so we'll keep going with the public order Oops. that's Sinope now these guys you are coming up to here let's build another watchtower what rebels are oh, just desert infantry or eastern infantry or whatever they are they are terrible oh wow got all these uh, got all these Egyptian armies now they have sieged down Alexandria this is not too much of a worry because if they try and assault their chariots are not going to be able to do anything really um, but we will bring this guy up to here anyway just in case Forward. Yeah, and then we are still recruiting. Do we do we need all these guys anymore? <sighs> Looks like we need a few still. Not brilliant. Um, we're still recruiting up at Carthage, so we're going to build an army here, send it down uh, into Namidia, and up to Iberia. We may have already cleared Iberia by the time that we can use it though, that's the only thing. Uh, we do need a, just a full stack army of good troops to, to send to Egypt, because they just won't be able to handle it. Orders. Oh, do we go south with this army? They are just going to keep sending up, you know, Gallic armies. 
if we don't. So I think we do. I think we go and sort them out. It's a lot of turns to get there, but we've got to do it. We've got to do it. I'm surprised there's no roads coming through here. Hmm. I wonder why. Cool. That looks like it. Let's uh, let's take the end turn. We haven't been expanding as quickly as before in this uh, in these last couple of videos, but we've just been kind of consolidating what's going on. Now, do we want to take a ceasefire? Honestly, that might be good because that will get rid of all their troops around us. We can take the two Seleucid towns and then attack, and it also might give us time to build up this army to send it across. It's not going to get there in time, but. Uh, we want to deal with, we want to send it to Alexandria side and we probably want to send the uh, non-Mariam army down south and the Marian army east to fight, um, to fight all their big armies. So let's do that. Yep, let's cease fire. Let's get the map information and map information, see whether they have, yeah, now we can see all their territories. That's all they have. Oh, well, well that was pointless, wasn't it? Why would you, why would you declare a ceasefire and then just attack me again? That was dumb. Can we retreat onto the boats? Yeah, we can. Well, <laughs> that's kind of baffling. But yeah, death stalks the land. To have him still. Hmm. Not ideal, but not much we can do really. Right, you. We want you in Eretium. Now, we could go for urban barracks. How do we get the next blacksmith? I think it might be we need the forum. Great forum we need. Which is this. I think urban barracks and then I'll just put the great forum in there as well. Um, just to remind me to do it. Strongest faction... <laughs> Brutii, really? <laughs> so yeah, Eretium. Now, Medellionium. This should allow us to get Legion and Cavalry. Yeah, let's go for that. Cool, and then we have the Armourer, so that's kind of good. Um, Carthage, Public Baths. Probably want the Blacksmith right now, honestly. We can still get Legion and Cohorts. Um, no, Praetorians, I assume that's because it's a large city. A huge city, I mean. Um, we need an ability to get legionary cavalry, though. And archers. This is going to give archers. Yeah, I think we go for the blacksmith. It always helps to have that extra armor. You just lose so many less troops, especially against missile, um, missile armies. Although, yeah, obviously Namidia and Spain. If like a third less of our troops die from the bull, war bull warriors um, peeler then that is a really good investment so it's worth doing it let's just go with the walls here just to make it look good honestly on the campaign map nothing else uh, Lugdunum, Mazaka mm, Mazaka we still need it's still worth us getting uh, public order. Ooh, look at the Egyptians. Like, look. Ah, they've sieged down. So we should actually go and fight the Egyptians here. What are we building Mazaka first? Build the sewers. Then Limonum. Can't build anything. That's fine. And then it's just repairs, isn't it? Yep, cool. So, where are we going with this army? Down to here. Yeah, making lots of recruitment, that's good. Um, and then this army has just been under siege again. <laughs> we do have a lot of cavalry in this army, that's the only thing. We might have to use the cavalry um, to our benefit by going out and attacking these guys while we have the opportunity. Like, what's even in this army? Like, it's nothing. We should be able to just smash that. Uh, we move that guy. Those guys. Okay, let's come down to Hatra then. March. No more moves, sir. Sir. Um, spy. Master, what is that is army? Sure. Pretty much all trash apart from the chariots. I still... I mean, we destroyed the chariots quite easily in the last few battles. It's still... They can do a lot of damage. 
This looks like the solution to the last two provinces as well. Um, General. So we want to go and destroy the Egyptians. But that should be it for this uh, for this episode, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, please do consider subscribing if you did enjoy and you want to keep watching these videos. We're bringing out more. Should be every single day, really, that we bring out one of these videos. So do keep tuned uh, for those. But thank you very much, guys. I'm glad, um, I hope you enjoyed and I should hopefully see you on the next video.